welcome to our channel in the last session we discussed iterator interface and how the iterator interface traverses the collection objects in forward direction we discussed with one example now in this session we are moving into the next cursor statement that is list iterator now it is also the interface from java.util package which is also used to retrieve the elements from the list objects from the list objects in both the directions or you observe the difference in by using iterator we can traverse in either set to list to or queue you can traverse in by using any interface but this list inter iterator is used to retrieve the elements only in the list interface but in both forward direction and backward direction generally this list iterator is a child interface of iterator only iterator is the main one this is the child interface what are different methods as usual has next method is available which is used to check next any element is available or not next method is available which is used to retrieve the next element and the control moves retrieve the element control moves to the next element here one more thing is there it can moves backward direction also so has previous think you got it what is the meaning it checks suppose if i am at position 5 fourth before element is available or not before element is available or not similarly how do retrieve the before element by using previous by using previous so these are some of the important methods these two to move in the forward direction these two to move in the backward direction backward direction in this we are using list iterator method list iterator method is used to create an object for the list iterator interface okay how same syntax list iterator some class name for example assume some integer list iterator is equal to ob dot list iterator what is ob on which collection object we are doing the operation that is ob again you observe what is the difference between iterator and list iterator iterator is used to display the collection objects only in forward direction list iterator is used to display from the list objects in both forward and backward direction this iterator is the parent interface for the list interface parent for the list interface now we will discuss one example program related to this list interface now this is our example in the last session um, for example or else take new one demo list iterator demo list iterator okay so import java dot util dot star create an object for which one any list that is array list to or link list to or vector or stack for that only vector some integer you got it why here you are using list iterator that is applicable only on the list interface classes is equal to 
new vector of integer so vector is created now display some set of elements list elements like previous one for int i is equal to 1 i less than or equal to some 10 i plus plus simply i am adding the element ob dot add of new integer of i simply i am adding 10 10 elements to the list I am adding 10 elements to the list. Now system dot out dot print ln ob dot to string display all the 10 elements. This is fine. Now I am using my iterator concept. How first to create an iterator list interface object list iterator integer some li is equal to ob dot list iterator method list iterator method is used for creating an implementation object for the list iterator interface now if you want move in all the directions first i am printing one message system dot out dot print ln forward direction just to for my understanding i am moving in forward direction while li dot has next if next any element is available system dot out dot print ln or print to display on the same line li dot next li dot next give some space so like this, I am moving element by element. Now display the elements in backward direction. Now forward is completed. Here, if you want any operations, you can do the operations. Instead of nest, what is the method name? Previous is the method. Here, the method name is previous the method name is previous this is the end of the loop save and run observe here i am reading 10 elements in forward direction the 10 elements are displayed in backward direction the 10 elements are displayed in the backward direction now you got it so by using this list iterator we can traverse on the list only in either forward direction backward direction Okay, clear. In the next session, we are moving to the next cursor statement enumeration. Thank you.